Okay, here's the first look at the Titan. And for size, I wanted to show it next to an iPhone. It's pretty much the same size in uh, height and width, and maybe twice as thick. So basically, you turn it on from this switch here. There's a three position switch of off, on, with mute and on with without mute. So you switch it on. So here we have uh, three or four containers of uh, isotopes. And I just wanted to show how sensitive this uh, LND 7317 tube is, even with these inside of uh, big thick lead containers. But you can see it's already picking up the radiation through the lead. A little bit over background. I'll take out one of them. I think two. Here we have uh, EU-152 and SR-90, uh, but you'll be able to see That's the alarm. It's set at 500 CPM, and to turn off the alarm, I now have a, a button here that turns it off. Even though it's still displaying that there's some radiation by the little icon on the screen, um, but we were able to mute the alarm by pushing the button here. Wait for it to go back to normal. Very sensitive. Just two hidden buttons underneath the label. One's for uh, backlight um, and you can't really see it too much in the daytime because uh, it's the easy, easiest to view it without the backlight during the day which is a straight display but uh, basically that's the you can see the icon for the backlight up there and there's a icon right here that tells you about the, uh, the battery life and right now it's full um, has a 1000 hour um, battery life with just uh, standard alkaline two AAs, which you can see underneath here. And the switch goes between CPM per uh, or UR per hour. That's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.